In this lesson, we are going to start with a blank canvas. In other words, I want us to delete the menus, all this content here, with the exception of this social share and the login. But everything else, I want us to get rid of it because we don't need it. When you start with a clean slate, it gives you much more flexibility so you know exactly you know how things are going to look you can put things where you want them to go so we'll first have to delete everything so once you've logged in to the back end you want to start first by deleting the pages these are all this information here which we don't need so you go to components k2 you go to items now in this particular template they're utilizing uh, an extension called the K2, which is, you know, a, a really great extension for how you present, you know, your content. So what we're doing here now is we're just going to delete it. So at the very, at the bottom here, where it says 20, you click on that and you just want to get it to 25. Okay, that's not all the content there, but that's at least, okay, you want to go to where it says all. Oh, I want to show everything that's there so that we can just scrap everything out. All right, so we have everything shown now. Just click on this checkbox here next to the title and it's going to check all the boxes. And then you want to click trash. So let's go ahead and trash that. All right, so now there's nothing there. Let's go to the categories and you have these categories here let's also do the same thing let's trash the categories and you get this message here just saying that are you sure you want to do this you know so just click OK OK so now we don't have anything right here and let's go over to the article manager and see if there's something there you know, there's there's two ways that you can present content with Joomla. You know, articles are also known as web pages. So you can use the default Joomla article manager, which is this one, or you can use the K2 extensions, which allows you to add more, you know, more flexibility in terms of your content presentation. So we have this one here and we don't necessarily need these. So let's just go ahead and delete this as well. So click on that check box next to status and you want to click on trash. All right, once you click on trash, you notice here that you have this one article that's still shown. That's because it has this lock on it. So just click on that lock. That's going to unlock it, allow you to delete it. So once you've unlocked it, you can click on trash. And it's going to delete it. So let's check out categories. We want to, once again, we're just clearing everything out. Just check this, click on trash. And it's going to delete the categories as well. All right, so there are no more categories. Let's check feature articles. There shouldn't be anything there. Okay, so now we have completely deleted the content. Let's go to the menu. Click on the main menu. And we're just going to write, we don't need all this here because we're going to rename these. So let's take a look here and click on the status. Now you want to uncheck where it says home because it wouldn't let you delete the default page. So once you've checked that, you have to uncheck the home. And let's just go ahead and just click on trash. And it's going to trash this particular menu. Okay. So we've trashed those. Now keep in mind that with, with Joomla, when you put something in trash, it's still in the system. If you want to retrieve it later, you can just go to where it says status and you go to trash. And all the items are still here. So if you want to restore them, you can always restore them. But in this case, we're not going to need them. Okay, so we have the home here and everything has been deleted. Now let's go to extensions module manager we are going to delete some of the modules that are here like with the popular and some of the ba the banner space and if you notice right now you have you know so many modules that are on that are showing 
And one thing too, you know here that you have this lock, you know, and in order for you to access this, you would have to unlock it. But there's so many of these that you don't want to click on each lock to unlock it. So what you want to do is you can use what's called a check in button here that can uncheck or unlock all of these. Or you can use go to system global check and what global check in is going to do is it's going to unlock every item on this the back end not just for the module positions but if there are some other things that needs to be unlocked uh, then you can use the global check in but we don't need to use the global check in so let's go ahead and click on the check box here and just click check in so all of this now that lock should disappear once it's checked in so okay all of those are gone so now we can proceed in terms of what we are deleting so we want to keep the login and we want to keep the social buttons here and i think we might just keep the finders on facebook here as well okay so let's go ahead and first check this top part where the social uh, buttons are located now from the module positions you know this is the social icons here and this is the user area so we want to make sure that we don't delete those particular items uh, let's go to first let's just refresh the page and see what we've got so once you refresh the home page okay you get this error Don't worry about that for now. We're going to sort, you know, sort everything out. And that is because we've we've deleted, you know, a lot of stuff that that's why this error is coming up. So let's continue on and check mark there and we are going to make sure that the module positions for the user area, we want to scroll down where it says the social, you want to uncheck the social. Let's uncheck the user area. And let's see here with the Facebook, find us on Facebook, let's uncheck that. And for the ads, let's see which one do we want to keep. All right, so we can always put those back there. So now let's go ahead and just delete once we've unchecked those, let's just go ahead and just uh, trash these. And once again, you're getting this error right now because there is no content that is really connecting. OK, so once we've added some content here, we've we left those. Now we have a blank slate. You know, we have just this find us on Facebook here, which you can update with your information. And we have the login to social share here. So everything pretty much is clean. You know, this is great. This is exactly what we want. So next, we are going to work on the menus.